Oh yeah. Hey, what's going on guys? Adam Brown of Vidges here, out doing another scuba diving adventure. We actually dove over the spot earlier today, but now I'm gonna jump back in and try to find a few more artifacts before the sun sh sets down. But we got uh, depths of history, exploring with Nug over there. And uh, I think you're sitting this one out, right? I am, I'm sitting this one out. I <laughs> I got in the water and and I had I had my video today. Nice. I, I'd had, had yeah, we, we had a pretty good adventure earlier, but me and Jeremy are gonna jump in real quick and hopefully find some treasures. Let's get it. Oh yeah. Uh, it's really beautiful out here and the sun's going down, so I'm gonna try to make it quick. So look in that water and find some treasure. Oh yeah. Thanks for joining me on another scuba diving adventure. Today I'm out in the river in Georgia and this video is a little shorter because it was a second dive of the day, but it's still a fun one. So I hope you guys enjoy watching the video. You know, we find all types of crazy stuff out here. As you can see, I found some type of brush here. Oh, God. Lots of trash, and a lot of times we can't even identify what it is, but we always try to clean up everything we can. Check this out. This is a whole boat battery in the water, so I definitely pulled this out because that's not good for the environment. That's not good. And I cannot believe I found a bone. This is actually not the first bone I found in this river. And this is pretty cool. I found part of what appears to be an old computer. That thing has definitely been in there a long time. There's no telling how long or what this actually went to. And I found some type of bullet casing. There's tons of these in the cracks. Pretty much any crack in this river, if you start fanning it, you're going to find bullets, fishing sinkers, even keys. Woo. Check it out, I found, I believe, a stop sign. Although this thing had been in there a long time. I couldn't even read it. And I love finding horseshoes. There's so much history in this particular river, too. So that's really cool I found that. Oh. <laughs> you know, I just float down backwards. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I keep finding them, the shells, but that's a whole uh, a whole pack there. That's pretty cool. Is that anything? I mean, there's clues. There's two big, you see the wagon wheels? Uh, the big frame, the big yeah. circle? Yeah. That's the, that's the wheel, the metal around the wooden wagon. Like, and I, yeah, I found a couple pieces of the wagon wheel. And that's my, that's, that's my That's cool, thing. yeah, I was looking for one of those. Just have, I was like, oh gosh. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pretty that baby up. Heck yeah. Shine like a nickel. I keep, I'm looking right here. I think like the horse, I found a horseshoe. I guess the horses came right here. And I'm diving around a little bit more and I found a bicycle frame, which that was pretty cool. Found a few other bottles. A lot of them are modern too. A couple old bottles. Definitely good to clean up out of the river though. And I have no idea what this thing is. At first I thought it was an artillery shell. I don't know. It looks like one of those artillery shells. I don't think so. Mm. Alright guys, just got out of the water and it was a pretty short dive. I still managed to find some cool stuff. And uh, you were just chilling all day, right? I was. I was just chilling, but I saw you guys <laughs> over there and it looked like you guys found some pretty interesting things. Yeah, I found a few things, not a ton. I mean, I got a couple, you know, some trash. I did find uh, another old horseshoe, one and a half horseshoe. So I don't know if that's good luck or bad luck or what. That's still cool. I thought this was like a missile, an artillery shell. <laughs> I still don't know what it is. Britain thinks, seems to think it's an old like doorway. I don't know. If you guys know, leave a comment. Let me know. That's what it looks like. But my best finds today were all this ammunition, or at least what's left of it. Found this whole case, a bunch of shells. So that's pretty cool. Jeremy, how'd you do today, man? I found a flattened three ringer. Britain, you said it was a what? 
Is it? Hammered poker chip. A hammered poker chip. Oh, yeah, chip. man. That thing's stretched out. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, I, it, it looks just like a three ringer just smashed. It does, yeah. So, uh, you can see on the. You can see where the three rings are on the side. Mm -hmm. Nice. Tis Heck cool. yeah, man. So there's definitely Civil War stuff out here. I also see? found an axe head that I think I'm going to try and oh, that, is, that is cool. I think it's melted. So if you guys want to see Jeremy's Look finds and his axe head, go Maybe. check out his video, Explore with Nug, like, comment, subscribe to yeah. all our channels, and we will see y'all in the next adventure. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thanks for watching the video guys, I hope you enjoyed this adventure. If you did, make sure to smash that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe to my channel, I really appreciate it. See you on the next one, Oh yeah.